Commissioner of Police Stephen Williams is looking forward to 2018 and he hopes the relative success the police have enjoyed in 2017 can continue. Ian Wason was at the weekly police media briefing where the top cops shared some statistics for 2017. Over 1,000 firearms have been seized by police in 2017 and this figure, according to the acting police commissioner Stephen Williams, is record-breaking. It's the highest um, annual total of firearm seizure uh, from my research in the English-speaking Caribbean. This isn't the only good statistic the top cop is smiling about. Another area is reduced number of road fatalities. In 2016, this country has seen the lowest road fatality rate in 16 years with 135 deaths. And with 11 days to go this year, 2017 can go even lower with 111 so far. He was also boasting as a country, the police have measured a 31% detection rate in crime, meeting the target of 30%. But he's concerned that while five of the nine police divisions have met and beat the target, four divisions have fallen under the line. So at the end of the day, we have had what I would describe as a, a very good year in many areas. Um, one area for which we have been defied that level of success is in the area of violent crimes. We have revisited and we are planning um, some key adjustments which would allow us um, to gain the success that the country is looking forward to in the area of violent crime reduction in 2018. The acting commissioner encouraged the drivers to be careful and to exercise responsibility during the festivities of the season. Ian Wason, C News. This good sentiment was echoed by Attorney General Faris al -Rawi. He told the post-cabinet news briefing that he has seen significant improvement in the efficiency of the Trinidad and Tobago Police Service for the year 2017. Speaking at the final post-cabinet media briefing for the year, A.G. al -Rawi commended officers for their commitment to service as he noted an increase in arrests and charges. For... Uh cash which has been stolen at the airport for instance arrest for murders arrest for rapes arrest for molestation gang related um, what we can describe as gang related activity even down to obstructing the roadways in protests 